If someone came to you and you have to make a diagnosis, I guess the next question then is, you know, what kind of testing would be done? And, and I know we actually have a list of some of the other diagnostic tools uh, that you use when examining someone who may or may not have epilepsy, and we have the, that list here as well. So again, just explain to us what you do if someone comes to you with some of those issues. Yeah, diagnosing seizures uh, sometimes is easy when you have mm -hmm. clear events, but sometimes it's very difficult, and the history is the most important part. When did the patient have the seizure? How did it happen? What was the patient doing? Was there any provoking factor, like there was you know, any use of illegal drugs or any medications mm -hmm. that are uh, that could have as a side effect seizures or even vaccinations. Sometimes vaccinations can have, uh, and, and some of those could have as a side effect. It doesn't mean that you don't have to have vaccinations, but there is no uh, medication or vaccination that cannot have side effects. That's part of it. Once that you have a clear history, if you don't find any provoking factors, the next thing is the neurological examination to see if there is any uh, focal signs of abnormal uh, neurological signs. And if you find some focality, that could uh, basically guide us to there is some condition in the brain. Blood test, yes, we do. Metabolic causes can uh, cause seizures, yes. Even hypothyroidism, you know, mm, that can right. be associated with seizures. And we do have other testing, including uh, the electroencephalogram, which we put to the electrodes uh, in the scalp, and we record the electrical potentials in the brain. And sometimes we see discharges that can guide us to uh, this being an uh, epileptic process. Sometimes we see even seizures during the EEG, and we are surprised. Wow. Uh, that happens sometimes. Spinal tap uh, is probably important, but that it would depend on the history of the patient in more acute conditions, and which we don't have explanation what is happening. And sometimes, uh, very important, like meningitis, needs to be rolled out right. rapidly. Spinal yeah. tap is a must in those cases.